What's up everybody, it's Blunt Goods, and today I'm going to be talking about the time that I got caught smoking weed. Now before I get onto the story time, I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit the subscribe button, the like button, or even just share with your friends. Now this story takes place when I was 13 years old, and it was Halloween. And on this particular day, me and one of my closest friends planned to go trick-or-treating with my girlfriend and her friends, and then when we were done with that, we are going to go spend the night with our friends in this high school in LA. These plans sounded fucking lit. Also, the friend that I was gonna go with, I'm pretty sure he's in some other previous story times, but I know for a fact that he is in the mushroom one. Let's just call this friend Tyrese. Now it's Halloween, I've already got my backpack packed, and now I'm just waiting to meet him at the bus stop. I meet him, we take some buses to the park that we we're gonna meet them at, and we we're just getting the day started. Now, to make this night work, I had to do some lying. My dad thinks I'm gonna be spending the night at Tyrese's house right across the street from us. When in reality, I'm about to go to high school in LA and spend the night there. Now we got to the park and met all my girlfriend's friends around like 2 p.m. Flash forward a couple hours, it's 9 p.m. now. Me and Tyrese are ready to go to the high school. We were hyped as fuck to leave this group. The entire day, me and Tyrese were just walking behind the back of this group, third wheeling this shit, and we were finally ready to leave. Now it's pretty late, the buses aren't coming. I can't ask my dad for a ride because I'm not even supposed to be here. The only way me and Tyrese can get a ride back to our city, back to where the buses are not disabled, is by calling my aunt who lived right down the street. Now calling my aunt was a last resort. I was scared of calling my aunt because I felt like if I called her, that for some magic reason, my family would find out. But me and Tyrese had no other ride, so I called her. I sent her the address, she's like, all right, I'm coming. I'm excited to go, I got a bag full of candy. I got some plans for tonight, it's about to be sick. Now my phone's ringing. Now all I feel is a bunch of notifications coming from my phone. I'm like, cool, she's finally here. Pick it up, guess who it is? My fucking dad. There's around 10 plus messages of just fucking sheer anger that he wrote into these text messages. And all of them are basically saying, get the fuck home. In the two seconds that I saw my phone screen, completely fucking flooded with text messages. I get a phone call, I answer it, he's pissed. I'm wondering how the fuck he found out. And now instead of my aunt coming to pick me up, my dad's gonna come pick me up. I already know he's gonna take my phone, so I just delete Instagram and I just delete fucking some apps. Which I am so retarded for not deleting anything on the camera roll. This park that we're at right now is like an hour to two hours away from my house. My dad got there in 20 minutes. Walking up to his car and opening that door was like the walk of shame. As soon as I got in there, my phone was taken. And he was just going off. Now, if you guys are kind of confused on why he's mad, I told him I was across the street from the house two hours ago. My dad doesn't even give Tyrese a ride home. We're in a pretty dangerous city that's pretty far away. And we had to leave Tyrese there. My dad didn't give a fuck, he left Tyrese there. And I felt so bad. Now when we got home, he asked me if I thought smoking was cool. And obviously he found out because there's videos of me doing it in my camera roll. He even searched my room, but he never found anything. Couldn't go out for a little bit. That was fucking horrible. Also guys, the way my dad found out I was somewhere else was because my aunt asked my stepmom for directions to the park. I don't know why, but that's what happened. If you guys made it to the end of the video, I appreciate it very much. Hit the subscribe button, that like button, and I'm out.